Have you ever wondered why ants work so hard in the summer? Picture two friends, an ant and a grasshopper. The ant, a diligent worker, spends his summer days tirelessly gathering food. He scurries to and fro, his tiny body carrying loads many times his size. He does not halt, he does not rest. His goal? To fill his storage with enough food to last the winter. On the other hand, there's the grasshopper. He dances through the long sunlit days, playing and basking in the fine weather. While the ant labors, the grasshopper laughs, his carefree attitude filling the air with contagious joy. He lives for the moment, not a worry in the world about what tomorrow might bring. Their choices starkly different, these two friends paint a vivid picture of contrast. The ant, with foresight and diligence, prepares for the future. Meanwhile, the grasshopper, with his carefree attitude, simply lives for the moment. Then came winter, a time of scarcity and hardship. As the world outside began to change, the once vibrant landscape transformed into a canvas of stark white. Trees stood bare, their leaves long gone, and the air held a biting chill. In the heart of this frosty landscape, the ant was nestled comfortably in his home. His diligent work during the summer had resulted in a bountiful store of food, enough to last him through the cold months. Warm and content, he was a picture of preparation and foresight. In sharp contrast was the grasshopper, left out in the cold with an empty stomach and a heavy heart. His days of joyous play in the summer sun seemed like a distant memory now. Hungry and freezing, he regretted not preparing for these harsh times. In desperation, he approached the ant, pleading for some food to sustain him through the winter. The ant was able to help the grasshopper, but only just. The grasshopper, still hungry, approached the ant once more. His eyes glistening with desperation, he pleaded with his friend, Can you spare a little more food? The ant, from the warmth of his home, responded with both sympathy and firmness. My friend, he began, I wish I could help you more, but the food I have now is just enough for my family to last until the end of winter. If I give you more, we too will starve. His words echoed in the cold night, a stark reminder of the choices made by the grasshopper. The ant continued. We had the entire summer to prepare for this time. While you chose to bask in the sun and play, I toiled under the same sun, storing food for the days like these. The ant's words weren't meant to chastise, but to impart a valuable lesson about foresight and preparation. Life, the ant went on, has its seasons. There are times of plenty, like the summer and times of scarcity, like the winter. The key is to balance enjoyment with preparation, to save some of today's bounty for tomorrow's need. The grasshopper stood in silent realization, the weight of his choices bearing down on him. The ant's words, though hard, were filled with wisdom and truth. The ant had planned for the winter, while the grasshopper had not. So, what can we learn from this story? This tale of the ant and the grasshopper, two good friends with very different approaches to life, is more than just a simple story. It's a lesson wrapped in a charming narrative. The ant, diligent and forward-thinking, worked hard in the summer, the season of abundance, gathering and storing food for the harsh winter ahead. The grasshopper, on the other hand, chose to revel in the summer's bounty, playing and enjoying the fine weather without a thought for the future. When winter rolled around, the ant was snug in his home, surrounded by the food he had worked so hard to gather. The grasshopper, however, found himself hungry and cold. Though the ant shared what he could, it wasn't enough to last the entire winter. The moral here is clear and resonates deeply with us all. It's a lesson about the importance of preparing for the future, of making wise decisions when resources are abundant. It's about understanding that times of plenty are often followed by times of scarcity, and it's essential to think ahead, to plan, and to save. This story encourages us to be more like the ant, to be prudent, and to consider the future in our present actions. It reminds us to be mindful of the changing seasons of our lives, and to prepare accordingly. Remember, winter, in our lives, represents a time when resources are scarce. Summer is when everything is abundant. So if you have a lot right now, save some of it for the winter.